Hi folks, Randy here from the Cisco Active Advisor team. I figure that by now you've already heard how Cisco Active Advisor can help you keep up with important information about your network. Like when an older device passes an end of life milestone or when a device's contract is about to expire. Well, in order to take advantage of those slick advisory features along with best practice recommendations, you're going to have to build an inventory. That's why I put together this short tutorial. First, point your browser at ciscoactiveadvisor.com. Then, enter your cisco.com credentials. This is the same username and password that you'd use to log into any of our sites. After you log in, you're going to want to add devices. So let's go ahead and click the Add Devices button, which will take us to our scanner page. Now on the scanner page, there are a number of different ways to get devices up into the portal. We're going to talk about the web scanner, but you can also upload a list of serial numbers from a CSV or XLS file. So we're going to enter an address range to scan. We can add up to three separate address ranges, but for the purposes of this demo, I'm only going to enter one. Then we add the level 15 credentials for logging into the devices in that address range. Again, we can add up three, but for the demo, I'm just going to use a single pair. Then I'm going to hit scan my network. And I'm going to sit back and relax. Let the Cisco Active Advisor scanner do all the work. So what's happening now is the scanner is trying to log into the devices on the network ranges that you supplied in the previous page using the credentials that we entered. The scanner is going to try SSH, Telnet, HTTPS, and HTTP to log into the network devices. When it's successful logging into the device, it's going to collect critical identification information from that device like the product ID and the serial number and the operating system version that it's running and send that information back to us here at Cisco so we can find the information you're interested in for management. We're going to find information like hardware into life notices on this device, software into life notices on the device, any field notices or p-certs that could apply to that device, and we're going to be able to tell you whether or not your device is covered under contract and warranty. Oh good, looks like it's finished and it's uploaded five devices successfully into my inventory. So I'm going to head on over to the inventory view. That's where I can see information about the inventory I've collected. If you have any questions about this, be sure and click this link down here on the bottom and take a look at our frequently asked questions. And if you're so inclined, you can enter some feedback and send it directly to the development team and let us know what you think about the service. Well, that's it. Y'all come back to ciscoactiveadvisor.com often and enjoy our site.